The remnants of Hurricane Ida, which left a trail of destruction in New Orleans, caused historic flooding in New York and surrounding areas. Floodwaters poured into the city's subway stations, crippling public transportation. At least nine deaths have been reported in northeastern states due to the weather. Some 250,000 people in the region have lost power. Kim Yeon Seung has the latest. The remnants of Hurricane Ida careened into New York Wednesday and unleashed a historic downpour. Flash flooding submerged New York City subways and closed all but one underground line. The flooding has led to at least seven deaths in the city. A two-year-old boy is reported to be among the victims. The rain was unlike anything the city's ever seen. The National Weather Service reports that Central Park collected more than three inches, or roughly eight centimeters, of rain in an hour. The agency issued a flash flood emergency for the first time in the city's history, only an hour after it issued the first emergency for New Jersey as well. The hurricane spawned tornadoes that tore through New Jersey and Pennsylvania. Reports say that at least two were killed in New Jersey, while at least nine homes in the state were destroyed. The rain also knocked out power to at least 250,000 people in New York, New Jersey and Pennsylvania. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy and New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio declared states of emergency in the affected areas Wednesday night. Kim Yansung, Arirang News.